Hey, what's up YouTube? Welcome to Quick Tech Solutions. Today on Tips and Reviews, I'm going to show you how to use an iPad as a second monitor for your Mac or PC. Stay tuned. All right, guys, I'm at the Duet Display website. How many times have you been working on a project and just wish you had some extra screen real estate so that you can keep open your mail client or a soft phone client? Well, with Duet Display, you can do just that because it uses your iPad as a second monitor. So here's how it works. You install a client on your computer, either a Mac or a PC. It does work on both platforms. And the client for the computer is free. Then you go to the App Store on your iOS device, most likely your iPad, and you download Duet Display for your iOS device. Simply connect your iPad to your computer using a lightning cable or a 30-pin connector, depending on your device. Now some might not like the idea that you're tethered with a cable, However, in an office environment, when you're using the iPad as a second monitor for extra screen real estate, what's the difference? Plus, you get the benefit of keeping your iOS device charged at the same time. Now, let's take a look at the compatibility. In order to use Duet Display with your computer, the desktops have to be running at least Mac OS 10.9 or Windows 7 or higher. The iPads have to be run in iOS 7 and as well as the iPhones, iOS 7 or above. Alright, I brought up my iPad on the screen now so I can give you a quick demo of how this works. Now, for the purpose of keeping this video on the shorter side, I've already gone ahead, downloaded and installed Duet Display on my iMac as well as on my iPad. So let me go ahead and launch the app on the iPad. It's launching. My iMac desktop flashed, and now I have my connected iPad. It's showing an extended desktop. So, let's take a look at some of the settings. On the iMac desktop, if I click, you'll see I have control of the extended display resolution. I also have control of enabling and disabling the touch bar. Now, what the touch bar does, it adds a little row at the bottom of the iPad where you can control your brightness, your volume, it's basically your F1 through F12 keys on your keyboard. You also could control the frame rate as well as the pixel quality. Okay, so let me grab my soft phone application from my iMac desktop and now I'm simply just going to drag it over onto the window of my iOS device. This is a simple quick and inexpensive way to add a second monitor to your work environment. There are some wireless options out there like Splashtop Desktop. The only problem I find personally with the wireless um, solutions is sometimes you get some lag between the two devices. So anyway, there you go guys. Duet Display, a tethered way to extend your iPad as another monitor for your computer. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel, put any comments you have down below. My name is Tony with Quick Tech Solutions. See you next time.